Hi everybody, I'm Hazel. Welcome back to another episode of Valheim. I am with my lovely wife. You're down there, right below me. Uh, yeah, I'm. my name's Theron. Hi. Yeah, that's their name. I remember now. Yeah, or except in this game, my name is... Is, is, is Baron. Baron. It sounds yeah. very dwarfy. Um, and yeah, we're playing Valheim. It's day three of Valheim, and we're working on building a house. Yeah. Uh, the sun's almost up, and we're making a flat place, and I can—I think I convinced Hazel to make an octagonal house. Yeah, we're going to try to build an octagon. I've never tried it before. My houses are usually just completely rectangular, because that's nice and easy. Uh, I did build a complex house like that once, and building the roof for weird shaped houses is hard. I I don't need a pretty roof. You saw my, you saw my house. Well, maybe I'll sneak in sometime uh, while you're not around and make it nice and pretty. Okay, so... How big do we want this octagonal monstrosity to be on a side. I, I think this is probably... Oh, um, I think three. Do you think three? Huh? Sure. Or do you I think, think that's too big? I think three is doable in this space. Okay. Do you want me to put the first one? Yeah, why don't we do... You, you put the first one and we'll work out from there. Out from, okay. So... Three and then at like a forty-five okay. degree angle. Yeah, it, there are on the mouse as you rotate. There are eight clicks to turn it one hundred and eighty degrees. So I could probably do the math on that. Do you do you want me to, or do we just want to say that like two clicks is good? I think two clicks is good. Two okay. clicks from. <laughs> The ground is not completely level, but I think we can probably level it after we build the walls, right? Yeah. I'm kind of hanging off in the middle of nowhere over here. This is going to be way bigger than an octagon. <laughs> I don't know what it's going to be. Well, there's the doorway. One, two, three, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, it's an octagon. Oh, cool. We guessed right. And I think that we need to put the door not where these rocks are since we don't have the ability to do anything about the well, rocks right now. <laughs> I thought until we could get rid of the rocks that that would just be our opening. Open. Yeah. Okay, can we get over it? Yeah. Cool. Uh, do we want to go taller than this? I mean, I think a double layer makes it a lot easier. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm going to run back to the little house because I have to repair my stuff. Okay. Um, oh, my hoe is almost dead, but I'm okay yeah. with my building stuff. Uh, come on, get up there. There you go. I will also grab some building supplies. Do we want any windows? Uh, windows might be nice. Oh, I have a... Oh, I'm carrying too much stuff, and that's why that's why Hugin is yelling at me. I love the way that you look when you're carrying too much stuff. You're all, like, sweaty and sad. Makes your butt look funny. Is there another half ball, or is it just this one? I 
tell. That's right. Okay. Oh, apparently I am hungry. I put a wood stack. Outside the door. Cool. How many windows do we want? I was just doing one in every middle portion. Oh, really? You don't think that's too many? I don't know. Probably fine. It makes construction a little more difficult, but that is okay. I'm getting the hang of it. Oh, I just am great clipping right through you. Oh, see, you don't appear to be near me. I mean, you're near me, but you're not. I can put the little one. Too late. Oh, you're faster than me. Okay. Um, we should probably probably do beans. I always forget about beans. We definitely need beams for um, the fireplace, wherever that's going to be. I don't know if you want to do it in the center. Or... I think towards the back, like the opposite of the door. Mm -hmm. It's like over here. I must be out of wood. There's wood just outside the door. There's like a yeah, wood stack. Yeah, mentioned. Crafting station needs a roof, right. Okay. I would. And... I'm going to go to the crafting station. Hello. I would like to repair some things, please. All right. Ooh, stairs. Fancy. beams and where I haven't. I don't understand what you mean by beams. I shouldn't lean in like that. <laughs> Are you just putting them on uh, like to support the little window guys? I'm putting them in the corners currently. Okay. Um, it really helps support big structures, especially when you're building tall, like roofs and. Um, okay. You want me to put little gyms? beams to support the windows, or do you think they don't need it? Um, little beams or big beams, either one. I don't know if they have a cost difference, but you can do either. Um, but we're probably going to we're going to need beams along the top in order to support the roof. You mean like build a structure, a couple of structures in the middle of the house? Um, I mean, we might need to do that, but I'm talking about these beams, the sideways ones along the top. Oh, okay. I can do that. Okay. Like, um, how does that, how does that work? Like, don't they need support underneath them? I mean, they've got the beams at each corner. Um, I think I have beams on each corner anyway. 
It doesn't look like this one does. Um, and... Oh, okay. So you want to build, like, out from the corners towards the middle? I... So, um, just along the current roof is what I was thinking at the at, uh, at the moment. So the current the current roof is meaning so me, I'm like, sorry. Like this. Oh okay. And then we might have to put big angledy chunks in order to support the roof. Um okay. but this will provide a base for doing that and make things stronger. Uh I don't see I much point picturing... in doing the floor right now. Okay. Because... I was picturing... I can't think of the words, so I don't know why I keep starting the sentence. You know how a lot of times a fancy high ceiling will have beams that go across it? Yeah. I was picturing that. Yeah. Uh, so like we have some of those. House. Like we have... They've got these big beams that are meant for helping to support roofs, like this. So we'll probably have to do those as well. I'm not sure where the best place, I mean, is maybe the eight corners. Um, we also need to build. I was, hmm? I was picturing just across, like from this corner to the one back across from, but there actually isn't a straight one. Is it eight sided or is it nine sided? I feel like maybe I'm wrong and it's an odd number of sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, it is. Yeah, it's eight. I mean, they have the beam that you're using and those could go straight across. Yeah. Uh, so what would you like to work on? next the roof i think okay but I, i'm not sure how to make the roof work with it at these angles yeah so do we want a 45 degree or a 26 degree probably roof? a 26 okay. um do what do we want to do for the chimney you said probably against the back wall do you want it to bump out from the back wall or yeah. Oh, sorry. I, I figure bump in from the back wall. So give us the most use of the fire, like, inside. Okay. I can move the workbench. <laughs> okay, so... Well... Well... Uh, so it has that window. Will that do anything? Or should I turn it into a large wall? Yeah, I mean, it would. It will probably vent out back that way. I'm not sure. Okay. Um, do we want a bigger? Do we want a bigger chimney? Like, do yeah, we want I was it to be... expect, I was expecting it to take up the whole wall. I didn't mean to. Destroy and be like a big firefly. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, a new door. <laughs> okay. Um, fix the door first. Uh, but narrow still, right? I think so. Or maybe um, we do this. Hmm. Yeah, we could do that. I am out of wood. So I will go go choppity chop, I guess. Okay. Just 
Too bad we can't plant berry bushes, or we couldn't before, and we don't know how. If that's a thing. Like, to transplant them or whatever, we could just put them around our house. It would be really nice and pretty, and we'd have food around. Well, we could plant stuff, but I don't think we could plant bushes. Like, we had, oh, we right. had a, a big crop of, I think it was carrots. Yeah, we eventually got the carrots. I'm gonna fight this guy off of ya. Okay. I didn't notice anybody was around. He was running up on ya. Are you also out of wood? Pretty much. <laughs> we don't need any saplings around here. Well, I mean, it's nice to have trees continue to grow in the area. But, you know, you don't have to be a conservationist if you don't want to. Well, I mean... I like to keep, I like to not destroy saplings, but I will destroy them if they're right around an area, so you're not having trees growing in right around the house. You know. Yes. But if they're further out, then I'm not gonna kill off saplings. Of course, we've got plenty of seeds. So we can plant. Mhm. Mm oh gosh, a seagull just flew right at me. My goodness. Oh, our house looks so pretty from the outside. I think I've never managed to kill one of those. I oh, you just do it with a bow and arrow. Mm. Maybe I have. You just get, I think you just get you feathers. You just get feathers. There. You don't get any meat. That's ridiculous. I'm going to go hunting because I am low on meat and I see a boar. Cool. Sounds good. I will continue chopping trees. Probably until my axe breaks and then I might on the chimney somewhere. Doesn't take long to break an axe, though. That was close. You almost kill yourself with a tree? Yeah. Gotta be careful. What do you think about the noise that the deer make? Did it's... deer make that noise? Uh, I don't remember exactly what it's like. It sounds like a wolf noise, like, arf, arf, arf. Oh, that is a little weird. I don't know if they bark. I'm not a hunting person, and deer generally don't make much noise from what I understand. I kind of imagine yeah. them like, I think I've heard moose sounds, so like mm -hmm. that, but not as thick is what I think of. So like, kind mm -hmm. of a... A groaning honk thing? Or something. Well, it's kind of like groany and honky. Oh gosh. I went just a little distance up this hill gathering berries and I can see the mountain biome. Hmm. I mean, I knew that it was close because, like, we flew right over it, or I did. Oh, there's some boars right at the edge of it. I just hope that no wolves come because cool. yeah. oh, it actually looks wolves like that this might be a confluence of um there's mountain and black forest right here next to each other at the edge of the meadows cool not a bad place to be yeah we're pretty close to stuff Okay. Is Black Forest right? I'm gonna walk into it and see if I got the right word for that. Probably. Uh, okay, so... Black Forest. Yes. And I will also walk into the... Oh, Hugin. Turn back! This is a dangerous place! <laughs> you must Prove never... Worth by slaying Ike there first. You must never enter the Black Forest. You'll never be ready. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I got the little like you. You. This is the mountains, so I can I can turn around, and come home now. It seems strange that we didn't find one of those standing stones that's like, hey, look at all these boar. Yeah. Hey, dude, look at all these boar. 
It is weird. There's quite a bit of black forest up here, actually. Oh gosh, I'm hearing some... Some angry boys, but I do not... I do not see them. What do you think a grayling is? Do you think that it's like a baby gray dwarf or if it's like something different? Uh, I do not know. Uh, I think that I see a full size gray dwarf right near our house. Yeah. He's right, he's right near us here. He's potentially about to kill me. No, I got him. Good. I'm glad they didn't kill you. You feel cold. Darn tootin' I feel cold. Okay, where's the chimney? Must be here. Oh, a torch. How fancy. They gave it to me for dying and coming here. Oh, nice. Yes, I am dying from smoke. I understand. Ah! Sorry, I was not trying to push you. I'm trying to, I'm trying to light your way. You know, the way you say it, Baron sort of sounds like Baron. Mm -hmm. Like the guy on the Buffalo's friend. Hmm. Okay. I figure just some roof sections pointing out from there is all we need. You know? Watching you suffocate. What size did I use? I used 26 degree. It looks like a 26. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm dying. I get it. The game is like, you're increasingly boxing yourself into a smoke-filled environment. Are you sure? Uh, 
Can I inverted one? No. Could put the inverted one. Does that fix my problem? Can you talk about what you're thinking about? So I'm trying, I'm just trying to get things to fit together so that when it rains, our fire doesn't go out. But I'm not sure what to do. So, uh... I mean, from the inside, I think it looks fine if you just put the sections like this. Hmm. And then one more. You think that'll do it? And we have like a cool arrow pointing to the gods <laughs> as well, which is kind of neat. Maybe um, one of the big X's in your outfit. Having trouble getting it where I want it. Like that. <laughs> you laugh, but I you do not explain. I don't, I don't know. I think we might need more roof up in the middle so that stuff doesn't come through. That might be fine. So the, like, rain, the rain might not put that out. One of these guys? Um, like one of the, one of the pointy boys. Pointy boys? Yeah, maybe a pointy boy. Mm, having trouble getting it to sit where I want it. Mm -hmm. Maybe if I turn it this way. Yes, yes, I'm dying. Oh, like this maybe? I can put two of them. Sure. I I trust in you. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, it's not pretty, but it works. I think it looks nice. Yeah, it doesn't look I think nice. it's very fancy. Okay, so... Uh, what do we need? We need more ladders. I'm not sure what you're doing because that that does leave gaps. What does the corner look like if we just try it like that? Oh, you're standing there. Sorry, I tried to build a roof on you. How rude. Mm -hmm. It is pretty rude. I, I think that the beams make it look bad enough already that it looks acceptable. Well, all right then. I mean, that's kind of how thatched roofs are built anyway. What do you mean? 
It's just you just pile a bunch of junk up there on top of each other. Yeah. Um. Should be right. Hmm. Come on, you can do it. Missing a requirement. I don't have enough wood. Okay. I have to go to the other the other house. Okay. Doom. Gotta repair my axe and then I gotta go farming for wood. Repair! I found some berries. First time. Nice. It keeps yelling at me to eat, but like, I'm not in any danger. Why would I eat? But you have enough health and stamina. For what? Chopping, building. The stuff you're doing. I'm out of wood. Took a while. Oh, the workbench counts as being under a roof now. Nice. Ugh. I got hit by a tree. Oh no. Where are you? I want to be with you. I'm going to... And I had your way. I'm on the other side. Yeah, I mean, you can see me. I see you're chasing deer around. No, I'm looking for the best tree. The best tree. Yeah. That makes... If you get, if you get a good high up tree, maybe it'll fall down on a lower tree and knock it over too. Mm -hmm. And you got to use less energy to knock it down. Yeah, I just kind of used that tactic. I mean, I just had two trees that were next to each other, and one Ooh. got stuck in the other, and then I knocked down the other one, so hoping that they were... But, uh... Bonk off some of them uh -oh. points. What's I got happened? a tree. A ro I got a rogue tree. It's just really rolling down the hill. Well, I'll head down there in a bit and see if I can help you out with your rogue tree problem. It's going to be taken care of by the time you head down. Oh, well, then I'll just go ahead and take care of my own rogue tree problem. Yeah, so I think I'm going to... I'm thinking about maybe heading back to the original place that we made mm -hmm. to grab all the stuff that we put in that chest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, that's a good plan. There's definitely okay. some wood in there, I think, okay. unless we use it. I'm... I will drop off our stuff, or my stuff, so that I have enough space. Oh, I will kill a grayling. Graylings are very brave. They wander outside the dark forest. It's true. Oh. I'm getting utterly killed by trees. Oh no. 
That's the logging. That's how logging goes. I've heard of many people getting badly injured. Experienced loggers. Every now and then. Doesn't go like you think it will. Okay, I put a wood pile at the front door again. Nice. Oh, I just punched a stump. I don't think that's going to work. You gotta punch a stump. Oh, I'm gonna kill this pig again. Again? How many times you gotta yeah, kill a pig respond. before it stays dead? He respawned. I don't want him to stay dead. Hold on there, Fruit and Annie. Oh, I found the, the rune stone with Wolf on it, but your viewers cannot read it while I'm reading it, so I will I will not for now, I guess. Mm. Wolf stone is my favorite. Well, maybe you can bring me over there someday. Oh, I will absolutely forget, but you will find it. And then I can be there and come over and read the Ulf stone. <laughs> Ooh, a stump. Those are my favorite. It looks like my wife doesn't like chopping down stumps. I don't like chopping the stumps, but also, like, I just kind of forget sometimes. Oh, we have so much wood in here. I think we might have more wood than I can carry. Cool. Yeah, there's still a stack of 50 in the chest at the original camp. Mm -hmm. I just stopped being able to pick up wood. Why have I stopped being able to pick up wood? Is it because I'm past the weight limit? Could be, I'm also carrying 40 stone. Oh, yes. Coming over here from the stone. It's very impressive to see uh, our pretty octagonal house up on the hill. It said it, the world save in 30 seconds thing popped up and I was like wolves in 30 seconds. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna go pick up the rest of it because it's really quite close. Uh -huh. Oh, a neck. Hello, boys. I would like to destroy you. Like to turn the two of you into me. Thank you for being so delicious. So 
here's a question that just occurred to me. Huh? Do you think that this game might actually be called Valheim? <laughs> Could be. I don't know. Why do you ask? I don't know. It just it struck me that like maybe we're saying the name wrong. Could be. If we are, let us know in the comments. Well, there might be a few holes in the roof, but it should be fine. I think it looks nice. And beams trying to stabilize the roof. A little. Yeah, they're happier up there now. Good. I mean, that was not happy. What's up to, hun? I'm 
also putting beans. Cool. All right, do you want to work on a floor, or...? Well, we can. I mean, we don't have to. I was going to build, like, a support beam leading up to the loop. Cool. Uh, looks like you've already got a bed. I should build a bed. Well, that... How do I... How do I get higher than this? Build a ladder. Alright. My bed. Oh, I do not have enough wood for a wood stack. I am surprised. Oh wow, that really made the roof a lot happier. Yeah. Beams are important. It took me a long time to learn how important beams were. It was mainly whenever I built that giant house. Oh, somebody's already been doing some pathing. Did you path yeah, all the way I've... there? No, it's just like to the river, basically. And I, I levelized the river a little bit so that we could walk across it. Like a little, I made a little land bridge. Cool. Ah, I see. Killing some necks. We were hanging out in my neck of the woods. Hey. Uh, not level, path. Okay, my wife is not going to like that, but it's a nice stable roof. <laughs> well, I already didn't like how sloppy the, the roof was, so... <laughs> um... How do I make... There are those, like, standing torches. 
Yeah, you have to have resin. There's some in a chest. I don't have the recipe for it, unless I'm not just not seeing it. Oh, you should. What is it called? Um, it is standing wood torch. You can make it. You just need a hammer, and to be near a workbench. It's oh, in the so furniture category. So it's not category. in the workbench. It's just in the. Yeah. Okay. It's in furniture. Okay, I mean, you made a path most of the way to the standing stones. You can yeah, only get so close to the standing stones, too, so... Oh, what is this runestone over here? Okay, I'm here. Okay, read away. Heed these words of Ulf. A poor settler in a strange land. You will find here good stone and wood, all you need to build a house. You will need to craft a roof to keep out the rain. And then you will need walls to stop the roof from falling down. Finally, you must have a door, or it will be much harder to go in and out. These things Ulf has learned for himself. Now he writes them on this stone to help others. Pray to Odin for his soul. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ulf is like my best friend. Because he's been helping you out. Yeah. I'm sitting in our lovely house. Oh, you found oh, out how to sit. All this you? Meat. you have to hit X. I'm standing in the chimbley. That seems unwise. It's fine. You, you don't seem to be having any issues. Oh, well, smoke's going up. What are you up to? I'm going to hunt this. To people. I'm going to hunt this deer. Ooh. I was thinking about pathing our way, my way down to the farming area. Mm -hmm. um, but it's probably easier to do that by going past the house than going back. Mm -hmm. um. Oh, I see you crouching over there. Yeah, I don't want to scare your deer away. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, should finish off this log while I'm over here. <laughs> oh, there's more deer around. I sneakily killed that log. <laughs> Yes, it was not me. You cannot see me. I am crouching. No, but before you killed that one, because I was still crouching, I didn't realize. Oh, I see. There's a guy following you.
So did you bring everything back from the old camp? Yep. Um, I even brought that old axe. Cool, cool, cool. You going to keep this little shack over here? I don't think so. But well, we don't have to destroy it immediately. Alright. But also, we can if you would like to. I'm currently cooking in here. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to move stuff from this chest to the chests over there. And then I got over here and I went inside. And then I was like, there's not a chest in here. It's outside. It's just outside. Yeah, I was in, I was looking in the chest when you went by me. We have chests in the house already? Yeah, I put one near each door. Or one oh, cool. on either side of the door, I guess, is what I mean. Mm -hmm. Um, I see one. I see one. Okay, well there, there are two chests in there. Unless I messed up somehow. Mm. Gotta level the floor a little more, I think. Yeah, I mean... If you can't level out the low part, which I couldn't... I mean... There is the thing that you can use stone to raise. So that might help. It also might say, hey, I can't do that. There's a wall in the way. Um, but if the floor's low, you can... Just try to reinforce that area with sticks, you know, beams, as they're properly called, I guess. So, uh, there's one here. I thought I put one right next to this door, but I guess I didn't. Oh, I was going to, and then I was out of wood. That's what happened. What's happening? I'm destroying a stairways. <coughs> Excuse me. Since we don't really need them anymore. I feel cold. What if I stand right here? I feel cold. I thought that I had already destroyed the stairways. Aha! Well, that makes two of us being wrong. Oh, I'm fine with that. Good job uh, on getting them connected and everything. I mean, this one's a little squiggly, but that's fine. <laughs> If I had realized what it would take, I would have, like, built the tall one and then built across to the other one. But, mm -hmm. you know, that's not how it worked. Oh, there are like so many seagulls. Yeah, there was a grayling. He was shouting out there. Ooh, a boar. Ooh, a new material. Day five. Hey, where are you going? Be mad at me. Fight me. Do, do, trophies. Mostly useless. For, well, I guess they're not. They're useful, but later. I think our house is a thing of beauty and a joy forever. Good. I'm glad that you like our house. Hello, workbench. Can I build something? Uh-oh, let's repair everything first. Now, should I build a bow? Or should I build clothes? Ah, 
I can build leather. Things. Or I could if I had enough deer hide. Yeah, deer hide is like... Oh, I have seven deer hide. But I do have enough it deer is hide. Not, it is not easy to get when you are at the very start. I should build pants. myself that flint knife that you like so much because I don't like it, but it is a good way to get deer early on. Yeah, I mean, there's also... Well, I have enough... We have enough to make a bow if you want a bow. I can build one, and then you can have it if you want. No, that's okay. I can I can, I can, can use a knife. You're the one who gathered all the deer, and that's like really valuable right now. And it won't be later, but right now it is. What do I need? Leather scraps. One more leather scrap in my pocket. We probably have one. Okay, let's go back to over here. We do have one leather scraps and one deer hide. They're in this chest that I'm currently looking at. Okay, now I am a master deer hunter, just like my wife. Congratulations. I should put on my pants. My fine leather Ooh, pants. you made leather pants? Yeah. Okay, so clothes. Let's put those over here. Put the arrows on top of my clothes. Your food, and you're just some rock. So that is it, everybody. Uh, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe. And we will see you all next time. Bye.